In today's video, I'm going to be doing a basic video to show you how to merge two different video files into a single video file using the free software from Microsoft called Microsoft ClipChamp. So you would have to go download this software. It's usually not a software that's put on computers. It is free in the Microsoft Store. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to open it up. I've already installed it. You have to have a Microsoft account in order to use this software. Microsoft accounts are free. So if you don't have one, you would need to create one. This is going to be what it looks like when you get into Microsoft ClipChamp. If you're not familiar with Microsoft ClipChamp, it's kind of the re um, replacement for the old Microsoft Movie Maker that used to be available back before Windows 10. I'm going to go ahead and minimize this real quick, and I'm going to show you I've got two different video files on my desktop. I've got video one, and I've got video two. If I double-click on video one, it's just a quick video of a... Blue Jay eating. I'm going to close it. Let's click on video two. And it's basically the same thing, but it's a northern cardinal eating. Let's say we want to merge these two videos together and make a single video. Maybe we're trying to do a bird documentary video or something like that. That's going to be our example for today. So I'm going to move these over because we're going to be using part of my desktop. In Microsoft ClipChamp, there's a whole lot of things you can do. It's basically designed for um, social media influencers, gamers, stuff like that. All we're going to do is stick with the basics today. We're going to click on create a new video. And once you get in, it's going to look like this. You're going to see the sub menu over here on the left hand side. For what we're doing, you really don't have to worry about any of this unless you wanted to get fancy with your video. We're going to simply click on the first video that we want to put in and we're going to drag it over. You could also click on import media and you can navigate to it. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the second video and I'm going to drag it over. It's putting it in this section called your media. Your media is basically the area that contains the pictures, videos, music that you're looking to try and put into a single project. So in my case, I've now got my two media files. Now I need to pick where do I want to put them in the project. I'm going to start with video one and I'm going to simply drag it down and drop it right there. Then I'm going to click video two and I'm going to do the same thing, but I'm going to drop it right after video one. So now in my project, it's combining my video one and my video two. I could click play here to watch and see what would the final product look like if we just did this as a single video. You'll notice when this first video finishes, it goes straight into my second video, which is what I want. So I'm going to go ahead and click pause. Now again, there's a lot of other things we could do here. We could add text, we could add captions, we could add audio, we could split, we could delete, we could do all kinds of things. But for our uh, purposes for today's video, we just want this single video. Everything looks good. We're going to simply click on export. We're going to choose our video quality and then it's going to automatically download it to your downloads folder or whatever folder you have designated as your default downloads folder. If you wanted to move it somewhere else, you could also do save to your computer and then you could choose a different directory. So now I'm done with Microsoft ClipChamp. I'm gonna go to my downloads folder and there's the video that we just created. It's a single video, but if I double click it and I play it, it contains the contents of both of the videos that I originally had. My first video of the Blue Jay, and then it goes straight into my second video of the Cardinal. Really simple stuff. That's how you merge two different video files into Microsoft ClipChamp. I should also say you don't have to just do it with two. Maybe you've got 50 videos that you want to put together in a single video. You could totally do it. You would just follow the same steps we just did, place them where you want, export the video. If this video helped, I hope you'll think about giving me a thumbs up. If you like videos like this, maybe you'll subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.